Come on, class, it's obvious! Good morning, class. What? Hello, kids. My name is... Mr. Not A Real Teacher. Second name Ish. And welcome to Spanish. When did you get here? Hello. Welcome to my Spanish culture project. Today we'll be talking about Spanish cuisine and the average meals of a normal Spanish day, starting with breakfast. For breakfast in Spain, you have tons of options. A common Spanish breakfast is pan con tomate, or in English, bread with tomatoes, which is not only tastefully simple, but also at the top of the healthy breakfast list. Or you could start your morning with a beautiful cafe and some churros, and maybe some bocadillos and various tostadas. Moving on to my favourite meal of the day, lunch. In Spain, you have plenty of options for it. You can have a classic paella, one of the most popular dishes in Spain. Or some sopa, which is perfect for some variety, having choices of carne, pescado, marisco and verladas. Or anything else you want really. There's not much limit to what you want in your lunch. Now for finishing dinner, you can have so much. Once again, the paella returns as a staple dish in Spanish dinners. Or for a change, you can have arroz with either some marisco, carne, or a vegetariano option. I hope I said that right. And some common sides are papas fritas, ensalada de verde, and vegetales asados. Personally, too many vegetables for me, but not surprising. For dessert, you have a selection of options, such as churros con chocolate, which, if you couldn't guess, is churros and chocolate. Some halado, whether it be strawberry, chocolate, or whatever flavour you want, or, to change things up, you could have arroz con leche, which, by the name, I'm sure you can guess what it is. But you're probably wondering, what about snacks? Well, everyone loves a good snack or two, or in my case, seven. So let's talk about some Spanish snacks. You could have merinda, a traditional Spanish snack usually eaten between dinner and lunch. Or have some churros, because who doesn't love more churros? Maybe enjoy a nice pairing of bocadillo and papas oragadas. I apologise, I cannot say that word right. Or some simple frutas or yoghurt. Because there's so many choices for a simple snack in Spain. So in conclusion, Spain's vast selection of foods makes for an amazing mealtime, morning, afternoon and night. We finally caught ya! Finally after so long! Now you're going to jail for a long time, buddy! You'll never take me alive, cops! No! You'll never take me! No! Wait, wasn't this math? Ba 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 da da